Uh, Israel has an inherent right of self-defense. Uh, Hamas is a terrorist organization and an Iranian proxy that seeks to wipe Israel off the map. They had actually put it into their charter calling for jihad. Hamas uh, has launched more than 3,100 rockets at Israel and counting. Israel's Iron Dome has blocked 90% of these rockets. Uh, it says a lot about Israel's neighbors that it needs uh, a complex missile defense system like this. Unfortunately, the United States has been there for Israel in the past. Uh, now is a time to ensure that we are standing shoulder to shoulder in this ultimate battle of good versus evil. Israel has been a loyal ally and partner, and there needs to be no daylight between, the is between Israel and the United States on this issue. Uh, unequivocally uh, ensuring that the, we are going to be providing uh, the precision-guided missiles that were promised uh, to Israel without delay. Uh, we should not be providing funding to an entity that incites violence and financially rewards terrorism. Uh, the administration, since coming in in January, uh, has been going in the, the opposite direction. Leadership, too, is going to require President Biden to be confronting uh, those within the ranks of the Democratic Party who want to see uh, the United States go in a different direction. Israel needs our support now more than ever. Unfortunately, there are those in Congress who are wanting to defund our military support of Israel. They're wanting to condemn Israel's right to defend itself. And that is totally wrong. And we're not going to let that happen.